Hey guys, welcome back to Clownfish TV. This is Neon. I am here with Geeky Sparkles. Hello. And we're going to talk about Master Chief's juicy ass. Uh, it's, a, it's chiseled butt. His chiseled butt. Yeah, what do you do? If Halo fans don't like the show, what do you do if you've never played the games and you want to attract viewers? You strip Pablo Schreiber naked and you prance him around on the set of the show that's supposedly supposed to be Halo and you show off his naked ass. People were concerned about Master Chief showing off his face. So what was the audition process like for that? Show us your cheeks, boy. We want you to act and then the second, or maybe the first part of the audition was show us your ass. Show us your ass, yeah. And then, and then if you got past that audition, then you actually could audition. Have you ever played the game? No? Okay, show us your ass, boy. All right, so we're gonna, we're gonna talk about that, and then we're gonna talk about the franchise becoming ass. Uh, apparently now we have a Halo cookbook. We know that we've reached a peak lifestyle brand. Right, right. With the, um, do they have recipes in it like rump roast and hot R cross buns? <laughs> Maybe they do sticky, <laughs> sticky dilly buns. <laughs> What's the dilly? I don't know. That's it's a web comic, Sticky Dilly Buns. Oh, I thought that I was like. I okay. don't know what a dilly is. I have no idea. Anyway, we're gonna we're gonna Sticky Dilly and in buns. We're whoa no. We're gonna talk about this in the spicy episode of of uh, Clownfish TV. Um, before we get into it any further, please subscribe for more pop culture news, views, and rants, guys. Over two hundred and sixty-two thousand subs. Yay! Please hit the subscribe button. YouTube doesn't like us anymore. No, they've never liked us. YouTube doesn't like us. I was gonna say who does like us, but that was nobody be likes yeah. us. Nobody likes people us. Do? 262,000 of you like us, and well, everybody else hates us. It's a significant amount more. It is. It's the weirdest thing. We did some analytics on our channel, and only like 12% of our views come from our subscribers. So the rest come from people that are either hate viewing us, or <laughs> yeah, they so, like us, but they're too afraid to follow. Yeah. So thank you very much for Probably all those Hollywood. those hate clicks. Love yeah. you. Love you, Hollywood. Anyway, we're gonna talk about this. Uh, Halo season one. Disclaimer, I haven't watched the entire episode yet. I've watched some clips. Uh, a good friend of ours, family friend, is a huge Halo fan. Pretty much every day or every other day, uh, he sends me clips of the show and tells me why it's so wrong. This, to him, is like The Last Jedi. Right. Was yeah, to us. Shira. Yeah, so it, it, it's very upsetting to him to see see his boy massacred mm -hmm. like this. What are you or massacred. about, boy? He's been massacred. Massacred. And uh, he's like, oh, my God, they're going to show his face. But that's not all. Why stop I, there? I haven't watched it at all either. Um, I don't even know if, if a naked ass is going to make me want to change my mind. Well, you know, all the all the ladies want to watch watch Master Chief. There's a lot of dudes who want to watch his cheeks, sure. too. Hey, I'm not judging. I'm sure they do. Uh, anyway, uh, anyway, uh, the audience score, not too good. Critical score did go up, but a lot of people said it's bland. And, you know, we've gone out there before. We've... That's their idea of spicing it up? Yeah. So what happens? Could if... we do, like, a good story or make it like the game? No. no. We're going to show his ass. Yeah. So after revealing Master Chief's face, the Halo TV series has now shown his nude bum. But we know what the next episode is going to have to show. Yep. Paramount's Halo TV has revealed yet more of its famously suited yeah. star. And fans remain split on whether or not this is a good thing. Split! It's a butt. There's a crack in the middle. I, I got that. I actually got that. I got I'm that sorry. reference. Oh, I'm so easily ad. amused. How do I get rid of this ad? There we go. Show it your ass. I don't want ads. It's my ad blocker. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, all right. Uh, the series' third slice of the series has unveiled his naked bottom. Fans have expressed surprise at seeing their suited hero standing in the butt uh, buff during the episode screened last night via Paramount Plus oh in the my U.S. God. Why is Chief naked? Without spoiling anything major, he's inspecting an object lodged at the base of his spine. And because he's Master Chief, he plans to perform the surgery to remove said object himself. Where Where is it inserted? Maybe they should send, some, send the surgeons in to pull the Paramount Plus's people's heads out of their asses. Show, because this is not necessary. Showing Chief's bum is perhaps another example of the TV show which has been declared non-canon, deviating from the established Master Chief war. <laughs> no, basically this is how we get people to actually watch the show because they're not basing it on the games. N nudity. Show nudity. his ass. Show that, his ass. That's all you need to do. And that'll make up for everything else that we are lacking in this in this show. When in doubt, whip it out. Well, they're not whipping it that out. They're just showing that'll his ass. That'll be next episode. Well, you know, the, 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 if the ratings go down low enough, they might have different cuts depending. Little Chief. <laughs> Little Chief. Little Chief. 
little chief. And anyway, in which <laughs> case, you should feel <laughs> free to carry chief. on anyway. imagining Master Chief's bum. This person here. Well, at least we know what Paramount Chief or what Master Chief's ass looks. We know what Paramount's ass looks like. <laughs> can't talk i'm blinded by the sight of the yeah we can't show ass. it because they have a picture of it at least now we know what master chief's ass looks like thank you paramount for truly understanding the halo fan base uh, that's right that's what we all wanted yeah this is i can't scroll any further because there's a lot of pictures of his naked ass that's right um, go to twitter if you want to see his naked ass or yeah. apparently all over the place yeah we got some tweets here uh, what the series gets wrong is that you aren't supposed to see Master Chief's juicy ass. This is basic storytelling. <laughs> what story is this his ass? Gamers, don't show me Master Chief's ass. No, face. Oh, face. Show me his ass instead. Yeah, Paramount. Okay, here's his chiseled ass. I can't talk. I'm so hot and bothered just, by this well, whole you can't get past, okay, let me, I can't get past ass. Okay, we'll read it again. Not without lube. <laughs> Gamers, don't show me Master Chief's face. Paramount. K. Okay, here's his chiseled ass. Here's his chiseled ass. Can't believe we saw Sierra 117 Savior of Earth Petty Officer Master Chief's ass. Yes, you can. It is current year. It is current year. Uh, but hey, uh, viewership record set. Uh, first episode. You know, I'm sure it didn't go very well with the reviews. I didn't, but now that there's more ass, I'm sure. I'm they're sure they're trying to back. set a new, another record. It's like, you wait. Know? You can see his ass. Yeah. How many times can we say ass in this video before you get I don't know. Toast? Anyway, uh, let's talk about the cookbook because this is probably going to be ass too. I was going to say, if our editors from the gaming channel were on this, they'd probably have a tally in the corner. Oh my God, they would. <laughs> I would send this one to them, but they're so good. It takes them a long time to put those videos together. Anyway, official Halo cookbook announced. The official cookbook has been announced and will release later this Year in August. This is coming from comicbook.com, the 192 page hardbound cookbook. Of course, it's hardbound. They've seen his ass. Hard. It's hard. This hard cookbook is said to include recipes from across the galaxy with step by step instructions and photos to make food inspired by the Halo universe. This is like the DD &D cookbook, the Star Wars cookbook. This is like now Halo has become a lifestyle brand. They can have chiseled butt cakes in there. Butt cakes. Bunt cakes. Oh, bunt cakes. Because, you know, they're kind of like, they, they have like the, the patterns on them, so they're chiseled, chiseled bunt cakes. They say an army marches on its stomach and the UNSC is no exception. The description of Halo, the official cookbook reads, learn to make awesome appetizers, sumptuous snacks, <laughs> decadent desserts, and main dishes to fuel even the hungriest of Spartans on the longest of missions. So my next question is, if the book doesn't sell well, are they just going to do an alternate version with his ass on the cover? With step-by-step -step instructions, beautiful, tasteful photography. This book gives you everything you need to go from Master Chief to Master Chef. Who writes this stuff? You know, I'm like, oh, you're so funny. That's a knee slapper. Oh, my God. So this person has done Fallout, the cookbook, Destiny, the cookbook, Street Fighter, the cookbook. How many cookbooks do they have? Final Fantasy XIV cookbook. I'll give them that one, maybe. Street Fighter the Cookbook. Street Fighter the Cookbook. Why would you want a cookbook for Street Fighter? <laughs> I don't know. So basically, you're, I mean, I want that job. I just get to make cookbooks for, for fan things. Oh, my God. So what do they do? Like, go, like, every Street Fighter character, like, whatever country they come from, they're like, oh, yeah, this is their favorite dish. It could be. Or, you know, I would love to compare the books because I wonder if they have, like, okay, well, we have main dishes. We know we need three sandwiches. It's the same sandwich. They just alter it slightly for each, you know? <sighs> In Chun Li's stage in Street Fighter 2, there's a guy sitting there choking the chicken in the market. So they have like Chun Li's chicken choker casserole. I I have no comment. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just trying to think like what would they do? You're looking at me like I have a third eye. We're talking about Master Chief's ass, okay? okay. Nothing nothing is off the table I at think this that point. Pr about parental guidance, you know. Uh, Every episode of Clownfish you know, TV disclaimer has. on the beginning has has naughtiness in it because that's just every every because we're terrible because we're terrible people okay <laughs> we are twitter thinks so i'm agreeing we're just gonna roll with it we're gonna become worse we're gonna become much much worse just because we can anyway 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 there you go guys uh you know if if you can watch show... halo now with more ass and not just talking about the... oh we didn't look at the reviews oh and not did... just talking about the reviews being bad well the reviews are Slightly better now than they used to be. Why? Because they put butt in it. 
Well, look at this. This is considered a, a positive review, a decent start that despite its best efforts failed to stun me, but it didn't drive me away either. That's considered a positive? It didn't suck enough for me to stop watching it yet. A plus. Ah, uh, A plus. But the bar was set really low. Uh, yeah. This... What are the audiences saying? Why does this show exist? Ass. Who's the right audience for something so bad that it becomes a parody? <laughs> it's just a poor man's Mandalorian where the writing is awful, characters are hollow and stupid. I don't care about any of these characters, and I don't want to. Master Chief even sounds like the Mandalorian himself. This first version of Master Chief has some identity issues. He does sound he does some dramatic outbursts, which is very uncharacteristic. It does show they don't they didn't go after the show more video games at all, and it goes on and on and on. But that but that's Cliffo. Now here we have Myco. Absolutely disappointing. It's not Halo. It's a cheap sci-fi with Halo skins. <laughs> I'm being good. I'm being Halo good. Halo skins. Took our boy's helmet off. We'll never forgive you. Forever will Chief's image be tainted with an, oh, great, he's just another regular guy. That's yet. not what they're tainting it with now. His taint. Oh, I was going to say that was a wrong hey, choice of words. Halo has oh, forever no. been tainted <laughs> by taint. Oh, my God. After I said it out loud, I was like, oh, no. Oh, no, I just gave it to him. This is a good TV show. Don't criticize it like a movie. The best part of the show is the first 15 minutes. That's what I've heard. That's what I've heard, too. That's what, uh, you know, our, our friend is like, yeah, the first, like, 10 or 15 minutes, I'm like, yeah, this isn't so bad. And then, oh, God. And that's kind of what happened with me with uh, Cowboy Bebop. Like, I tried to watch Cowboy Bebop, and I was like, the first 10 or 15 minutes until Faye showed up, I was like, okay, this this isn't the worst thing ever. It's like if Quentin Tarantino did a Cowboy Bebop-esque movie. It's not terrible. I like both of those things. And then Faye showed up, and I was like, oh, screw this. Honestly, Paramount, what were you thinking? Letting two showrunners who admittedly didn't play or even consider the games run the series. This is a huge injustice and would have been so easier to make better. Well, this is like along the lines of so many other shows and movies. They didn't watch the original but wanted to appropriate it. Yeah. And then, you know, ruined it. Thank God for Sonic. Sonic actually got it right. We didn't need to show Sonic's ass. I guess Sonic's always showing his ass because he doesn't wear pants. But, you know. We I never really actually thought about that and looked. He's naked except for sneakers. That's a kink for some people. Anyway. Okay, can we just stop? Yeah, I think we're going to stop this video. We need to We need to end it right now, right? Yes. Just end it all. End this show, Paramount. No, it's already been renewed, so. It's been renewed? It's been renewed. Wait, 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 wait. So it's doing shit. Yes. Audiences hate it. Yes. The critics are in, yes. and they renewed it. Well, that's right. It wasn't renewed before it even came out. Yeah. That's right. I do remember yeah. that. Yes, it was renewed before it even came out. Yeah, you should have not done that. No, they, even the showrunners they quit before <laughs> the first season came out. They're like, screw this. <laughs> anyway. Well, that's what they're trying to show you. Screw this. Yeah, if you want to see Master Chief's ass, go right ahead and... Uh, I don't think it's in the cookbook, though. It's not in the cookbook. But they'd probably make a lot more money if it was. They would. If they put it on the cover. Yeah. Anyway, we're going to wrap it up. Yep. Please subscribe for more pop culture news, views, and rants, guys. We'll talk later. Mm, bye. Can't wait to see the plushies. Now he's just tasty, delicious, rotten flesh meat, which I can consume and don't read into it too much. Just like our museum, the cafe, it's open to Brewster is eager to serve. I don't think this was in the show. You know, run, 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 run. Oh, oh you got splatted. No. Oh, wait, oh, wait, oh she was begging and what? you kicked her in the face. I don't care. Hey guys, Squid King here, and today we're in a. <gasps> not girl boss, not girl boss at all. She is not a material girl. She is not. Oh, it's Christmas time here in your mom. Nobody wants to join your mom. What? Like, I can't even cook kid cuisine right. I would last about two minutes with Gordon Ramsay. What? Where is he? He's hiding. He's hiding from you. He better. Oh my god, you got the axe. Walker, does this look like Steven Universe? Let me punch him. Well, I'm just here for the wax. Ah! Right where you belong. Get in the dirt. Well, that was a combination of events I probably shouldn't have put together. Anyways, let's open this bottle too. Chica Pinata. Is that official? Oh, no. There's a bootleg. Hello. Oh, I'm sorry. Hey guys, it's Diamond Tool. Let's make a farm. Like and subscribe and buy my merch. I mean, while you're here, you guys should like really like and subscribe and buy our merch, all of which we have. <laughs> that is true. You can't run them carrying trash. And you can get away with one F-bomb per PG-13 movie. Oh, I wish I'd yeah. known that sooner. Yeah. All right, so we're gonna wrap this effort up. Yes. <laughs>